what does that mean, right? So some of you are like, you know, that's crazy. You can't tell me by charging 150 up front that's going to attract the right person. And the reality is it will. Then the reason why that is, is because you want to attract people to your business that value your service. And if you don't value your service, why the hell would they value your service? So that usually is a mindset shift that you have to make in order for people to make that in terms of who you're going to attract. If you think it's okay to give away your knowledge, your expertise, your um, advocacy, your, <laughs> I mean, just I could go on with all of the different things that um, you bring to the table as a professional, right? If it, you give away that service, right, you immediately devalue your proposition, right? People don't value free. They don't. They say they like free, but they don't value free when it comes to services. They really don't, right? And 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 I've got too many evidence, and you and you've given me too much evidence as well for me to confirm that statement. Which is, you've given away your services. You've booked. I'm I'm sorry. You haven't booked. You've quoted. You've done the research. You've spent a lot of time painstakingly looking and and finding the best combination that would give your client the best fill in the blank experience based on their requirements and they did not buy, right? So you did all of this work and you didn't get, you didn't get paid for it, right? You didn't, you didn't value your time, your effort, your expertise, and neither did they. And they took your information and what did they do with it? They said, thank you. And then they booked elsewhere, right? So my you know, tip for you is if you want to hit your numbers, forget IATA, let's talk about your bottom line, right? Include charging an agency fee and one of those agency fees should be your design fee for doing quotes for your clients. Does that make sense?